Hey everyone, this is Grant, developer evangelist on the OpenShift team at Red Hat. I'm going to quickly show you the BeerShift application, which we're going to be developing over the next couple of blog posts in this series. The technology used for this application is the Titanium SDK, Titanium Studio, OpenShift, which is a platform as a service cloud hosting provider, and MongoDB, which is the database for the application. As you can see, I have a BeerShift icon just like I would expect so let's go ahead and start the application and I'm dropped into a search screen but let's go ahead and log in so I have a blog demo account that I've created I'm actually going to use a bad password so that we can see that it has native UI elements just like we would expect um, let me go ahead and log in here and let's search for a beer let's search for cores maybe and we can see Coors Light, Coors Original. Now this will return any beer um, that has Coors in the name in, or in the brewery name. So if we click on Coors Light, we can see that it's uh, by Coors Brewing Company. We can read a description and we can also drink that beer. Another option is we can go to the keg stand tab at the bottom and this is where we can see what everyone around us is drinking. So you can see the blog demo account which I'm logged into now drank Coors Light which we just did, a Bud Light a few minutes ago and a West Mall. So if we go back to the drink tab this lists the beers that we have currently drank um, under this user account. So this user blog demos only drank three beers. So if we look at the West Mall Trappist Triple um, we can see when I drink it and this area right here is actually black. During the blog series we're actually going to add geolocation and a map to this and that'll probably be the third post in the series. So that's the application. It does look and run the same both on the Android and the iOS devices and look forward to, uh, to developing this application with you.